hello 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 welcome to the channel today we will be looking into actually we'll be looking into this for the first time i have always wanted to try this so i am going to log into the arduino code i guess you probably are wondering how did i get there so um so when you go to this arduino to download the software and notice that you can code like an arduino web editor and I was like, whoa, this is cool. Let's check it out. So I am going to try to sign in and experiment with it. So I'm going to log in. I will cut this out of the recording. All right, here we go. So it looks like it wants me to download it. So let's go ahead and learn more. And I'm going to download it. Start. Yeah, I have win 64. So we need to. Oh, so I have to download something. I might as well just download the regular copy. But the reason why I think this might be good so that you can write a code, whether with your computer or someone else's computer or anywhere, as long as you log into your portal, you could see your previous code, I think. Um, but we'll see. Mm -hmm. Let's accept. Uh, yeah, we we. I predominantly use Chrome, so no need to make it work hard. All right, let's try to connect again. All right, it looks like we are connected. Next, go to web editor. Look at that. This is really cool. All right, here we go. All right, let's go back to that example code. And uh, unfortunately, I will not be able to show you if it's working, but I can uh, obviously confirm it verbally. Uh, all right, so this is the code. Let's go ahead and upload it. I'm going to verify if it's blanking. Ooh, it is blinking. That is cool. That is cool. It worked. All right, that's it. I will talk to you later. We learned something new today. All right, I will talk to you later. Oh, yeah, don't forget to subscribe because you can see me trying something new every single time. <laughs> if, if, you, if, if, if you're interested. Bye-bye.